I barely got it. Is that my friend? That's my buddy. He didn't even see me. That's my friend, uh... That's my friend... <laughs> what? <laughs> I can't remember his name right now. What's, our, what's the matter with me? Damn stupid brain. Jerry, Jerry, was it him? Did he even notice me? Ah, I wanted to get that nice setting, not ghetto, not typical Montreal. Oh, look at that. Oh my God, there's a classic Mercedes SL there. Oh, I don't believe it. Wow. Just to go along with things. And it's funny because look at typical. Well, it's in the neighborhood. Typical yeah. wealthy old man. Oh, that sounds good though. Oh, that sounds that sounds really good. Yeah, should be able to get one of these things driving, eh? Good old Dodge. Passing another Dodge. <laughs> and there's a an Astro on the left. That goes to show you. If that doesn't show you how many old vans are in my neighborhood, I don't know what does. And I might as well take this opportunity to show this stupid configuration they did. Because we have a mayor who is such a smart ass. Basically, whatever she says goes. So whatever you want to put bike paths anywhere, no big deal. It's fine. It's not fine with me. I think it's just annoying. Especially if you're a motorist. That means there's less places to park. There's more traffic. Uh, anyway, it is what it is. Oh, man, it's an M3. I almost missed it. Okay, little fender bender there, but Mew just noticed that Mercedes SEC for crying out loud. Look at that. You never see those cars, man. They're always four doors. SLs, look at that. Atta. Gee, it's about time I catch an old van. I've seen so many today. Oh, classic vet. Do I know? That's my friend. I know him. There you go. Ah, now there is a Volkswagen I like. Got that classic rear air cooled four cylinder sound. Is he? Can I wait? Do I want to wait? Did he turn? There he goes. Look at that, classic Econoline, extended body with some funky background, yeah. Look at that shot with the monument. Yeah, I don't know why for a second I thought that thing had a six cylinder. Why would you have an extended body with a six cylinder? Mm. Yeah, I'm looking at a coach, look at this charger. Oh, man, man. Oh, classic, classic, likely 70s 911 Carrera. Isn't that a beautiful thing? Ooh, baby. Love oh, wow, that's the only oldie I've seen all day. Vintage Ford Bronco, an original. Right here in the West Island, right off St. John's Boulevard. I don't believe it, man. How cool is that? Was OJ driving it? <laughs> it's not that old. <laughs> I might get him turning, though. I'm sure the guy must have noticed my Cold War Motors shirt. There you go. Look at that beauty. Oh, and it sounds great, too. Ah, oh, it's perfect. Totally stock. Oh, barely got it. Barely got that Cadillac. Oh, my God. Is that ever beauty? Cadillac. Modern 350 or 305 in there. Oh, my God. Sorry, that's a LaSalle. LaSalle was like a cheaper version of a Cadillac. It was smaller. This looks like a 37, 38. Yeah, it's probably got a 305, 350 V8 in it. So it's more reliable. Awesome. It's a Buick. It's a freaking Buick. It's a four door hardtop Buick. What a crappy black paint above. Wow, that's rare. And I'm not surprised that he came off the bridge to come here. That is very, very rare. That's like a mid 80s. Yeah, M3, right? Yeah. Holy yeah. cow. Man, you know, when I was a kid, I remember in Roxborough that we had a guy a few couple of streets over. He had like a 39 Chevy Hot Rod or something, and he had one of these, I think, for a brief time. You're going to have to hold on a second. I don't get the light. <laughs> I think it was an yeah. Alp Alpina, actually. And the Alpina was like the race version, if I'm not mistaken. Alpina, yeah, or, well, kind of like the Grand Touring Luxury or Fast Luxury kind of thing. Oh man, there it is again! 
the classic early 60s, mid 60s combi. The most desirable, well, it's not the most desirable one, but almost. The one, most, the ones that are desirable are these same buses, but they have like 24 windows. Little standy type windows from like the old buses, you know what I mean? Wow, look at that with the scrap there in front of it. It's so, ah, there. All right, we'll try that again. The uh, camera stopped recording. It's doing that lately because it doesn't like the cold because it's a piece of shit. Just like that Chrysler. Looks good. Oh, look at that. Among all the white cars is a classic 80s Cadillac. Fleawood Brome, which I've rode in many of these. I wish I could ride in one right now. But I gotta take scrap. Thanks to the STM. Remember a few years ago, me and Ed looked at one of these for sale near his place in Montreal West. Could actually be the same car. Ah, shoot. I missed it. The guy honked the horn. It was the original horn to those cars. It's like a... I don't know, I think it might have been a, an exclusive Cadillac type of horn. Not a regular car horn. Come on now. Oh, I've seen this guy before. I think that I was going to yell out to that guy. Is that from Australia? Yeah, seen this one a few times. Ooh, sounds like Flowmasters or Cherry Bombs, baby. Oh, baby, 1970 Chevrolet Impala. I was on the bus just to get this. I just got off. Oh my God, look at the wheels on this thing. Whoa, Daddy O. Ooh, that thing is crazy. Hey, yeah, hey, hey. <laughs> yeah. I barely got him. <laughs> barely, barely got him. Man, he must have a 454 in there souped up and stroked up for sure. There's that Eldorado. That's sharp, man. Look at that thing's a Damn, it's funny to see this 80s square body go by me. Because uh, about 10, 15 minutes ago, I see the 77 to 79 Continental. Old man's coming up to it there. And, uh... I asked him, I said, 78? It doesn't say anything. I said, 77, 79? It doesn't say anything. And then he says, take a picture, $20. I said, yeah, you're funny. You know what I mean? Like, you know, we live in a society. I'm trying to be nice. I'm trying to be friendly. You know what I'm saying? That a rich old prick, I guess. Well, it's nice to see some people still have some kahunas to own old vehicles in the city, which is rare. Especially, I love to see that in old parts of town like this. Yeah, buddy! And remember, it's not a crime to do photography or to film unless, don't go on private property and I say that next to a police officer, so bye-bye. Look at the old Topaz. God, you know the last time I saw one of those, it was in Lachine and it drove by the bus and it was all like scraped the whole side, completely wrecked like a car from New York. Look at that old square body on a Sunday morning. Yeah, Built to last forever, good old Chevrolet. Wasn't I just thinking about one of these yesterday, I think? 87, man. <laughs> How about that? And now something was... That is so cool with the glow of the tail light through the window. Wow. Bro, this is great timing. Except the camera doesn't want to stay oh, forward. Is here. Yeah. Uh, bye bye, smut stang. Maybe we'll speak each, other, each other again. We'll be out all night. No. Oh, look what I just happened to get. Hey, that's epic, isn't it? Hey, eh? you know, buses in Montreal, that's a scrap. There's so many of them out in this area. It's unbelievable. And right in front of it looks like a VW van that I might have actually gotten a picture of uh, a couple of years before I went over and uh, transitioned to digital photo. I took a slight picture, I think, of this thing. I think it was on St. Tiberius Street. On the Bulgana Metro over there. Oh. There you go. 
Don't forget to floor that thing when you get on the highway. There's no power at all. And there it is again. Gonna go northbound on Highway 25. My bad. I'm going to Hochelaga Boulevard, I guess. Or northward. Great shade, man. I think it looks like mint. Enjoying really, literally, like it's come down to less than two weeks left before uh, pretty much everything goes in storage, eh? And then in Quebec, the, uh, the law is that you have to have your snows on by uh, the 1st of December. Whoa, look at that! Get out of here! Holy mackerel, classic Monte Carlo. I got the camera ready because there's an ambulance coming, I think, somewhere. Holy mackerel. Dang, stupid. If I had my regular phone, though, I would have zoomed in easily. Shoot. Wow, well, that's funny to see this Camaro, guys, here in Valley Field, because before, earlier, we were in St. Clair and I saw one in the driveway. Uh, I was like, what's that smell? I look up and I see this old Camaro. All the carbon monoxide, noxious fumes kicking up leaves, getting to the end of no October. <laughs> I know. I <laughs> said with motorcycles going by. So that's not where he was going. Trying to figure out where he was going. Huh? Probably Look. repainted. That's good though. That's the what a perfect place to see this ultimate classic on a Saturday at a, for a wedding. Look at this, right outside La Cathedrale. A trip.